Warhammer 40k Rogue Trader Origin Navy Officer Guide Let's check the origin Let's go Are you ready for the Warhammer 40k Rogue Trader? Because I am The Emperor Protects What is the Navy officer? The main role is a support, a ranged support, ballistics support, but basically this is an all around origin rogue trade. The main feature would be brace for impact. For one round, the Navy officer and their allies in a 3 cell radius around them gain plus 2 deflection for each arch type taken by the Navy officer. They also cannot be forcefully moved or over penetrated. Archetype is basically a class, so the higher the level, the stronger the Brace for Impact is. You can say that this is like a weaker Origin Rogue Trader at the start of the game, and as it moves on, he becomes stronger and stronger, so this is like a late game Origin. In other words, to short this up, what Navy Officer provides is defense for the entire party. Top of it all, there is no overpenetration from enemies on your teammates when you have a navy officer, and no one can push your companions around you. From the talents, the first one in line would be do not falter. All allies affected by brace for impact do not suffer the negative effects of melee superiority for the entire combat. Enemies do not receive melee superiority, or in other words, they cannot overwhelm you. Okay, no matter if there's three times more enemies than your team. Considering how many fights there are with multiple enemies at the same time, this is actually a very good talent. The next one would be Scatter. All allies affected by Brace for Impact suffer only half damage from all attacks of opportunity. If you're gonna move and pass through enemies, then yeah, they receiving half damage from attacks of opportunity is useful, okay? But basically, if you know how to position, this is a useless talent. The next talent would be perfect timing. All allies affected by brace for impact will gain 30% to cover penetration. The navy officer also permanently gains 15% to cover penetration. You basically you will hurt enemies in cover more. No one can hide from your teammates. The next talent would be get off me. With Brace for Impact, now it will also allow the Navy officer to use any ranged weapon in threatened areas, knock enemies prone and push them one cell away during the effect. What does it mean? Basically, you push them from full cover and they're in the open now and you realize you have higher hit chance against them. Very useful talent, to be honest. And the last talent would be getting to cover. All allies affected by Brace for Impact gain a bonus turn with 0 action points and 3 movement points and they increase their cover efficiency by 20% for a round. It's a movement ability, okay? You click on an ally and if they're in the open, 3 movement points, you put them into half cover, full cover, okay? So they avoid damage if they can. Useful, getting to cover is quite useful talent skill call it how you like so what would be the home world for the navy officer the best one to take by far would be imperial world all around because navy officer is also all around okay also what merges very well if you want to deal damage would be the fortress world and of course if you plan to play a navy officer as a full support then you're gonna go with a high world for your home world so these three, Hive, Imperial and Fortress merge well with a Navy officer. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I thank to all of my Patreons and all of the members on my YouTube channel. As always, thank you all for your support and I'll be seeing you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Emperor protects.